Disney World! We made it! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Walt Disney World Dolphin Hotel. This is my first time staying here. It's a beautiful big hotel. Um, as we're walking in, over to the right is Fuel, which is a, the coffee location here. And here is the beautiful lobby. Look how ginormous this is with that beautiful chandelier. Now to the left of this lobby area is check-in. Continuing around the circle is the elevators. Over there, they have Disney Planning Center to plan your vacation. And then to the right, they have gifts and sundries and bus transportation on that side. Okay, so walking through the lobby just a little bit, I really want to check out this gift store to see how much they really sell here. My goal on this Disney World trip is to get metal earth kits, which are super niche, and pins, which are definitely not. So this is it. It's pretty small. It's pretty limited selection, but they do have pins. So here is the main pyramid of the dolphin. Right across the way is the water taxi and the swan. And right over there, you can kind of see the Mexico Pavilion over at Epcot, and then Disney Springs is way back there. This is our hotel room. It's pretty standard. We have uh, two beds. It has a mobile remote, which is pretty cool. And then some closet space in the front. Here's a quick overview of the bathroom here. Nice shower, very pretty artwork. It also comes with a desk and a chair. And we're gonna head out of here and go right there to the boardwalk towards Epcot. So here we are leaving this massive, massive dolphin hotel and we are walking towards the Swan, uh, almost right in front of the Swan. We're gonna make a left and head right there to the boardwalk. This is a very cool sign walking towards the boardwalk. Now the boardwalk has basically two hotels. There's the main boardwalk and then the boardwalk villas, which are part of Disney Vacation Club. One thing I'll notice as we're going towards the boardwalk is a lot of these lights on the path are not lit up and the sign isn't lit up. I don't know if that's a COVID thing or what. My phone is making it look a lot brighter than it is. It's really not that bright. We'll see as we come out if it's turned on or not, but it's very dark right now. So, you know, I don't think it's a COVID thing because right here, the dueling pianos, it, the N isn't lit up. This is also very interesting. I don't know how long ago this happened, but this used to be a sports bar over here on the corner and it's no longer. It still says ESPN, but it's not a sports bar anymore. So we decided to come into the lobby of the boardwalk to eat our pizza. I'm almost done. Over there is the boardwalk side and then here's the villa side. And we're about to have our Mickey brownie for dessert that looks really good. We couldn't have the whole thing to ourselves, so we're splitting it. Before heading back, I just want to look around this lobby because the the decoration is so pretty, including this roller coaster, which is hard to see because of the glass, but it's really, really pretty. And this really cool chandelier right in front of the regular boardwalk in, and this neat carousel. Before leaving, I just want to kind of explore the boardwalk, and here's the gym on this side. And coming this way, I want to check out the pool because they just redid this slide. Okay, so we made a mistake. We thought we could walk out this way on this side of the Keister Coaster and we can't. So we have to walk back out that way and then make a left and that'll get us back to the hotel. So this is where we want to go. Past the arcade games and then the, uh, the workout room, the gym over here to the right. So coming back, it has gotten a lot darker. You can see these lights on the, these path lights are still out and the boardwalk sign is still not lit up. So I don't know what this is. You can see there are people in front of us who, again, are more visible on the camera than they are in real life. It's just real, real, real dark here. You can kind of see right now above the Swan Hotel, the spotlights that are shining from Disney's Hollywood Studios. I had no idea they were putting these in so early. They were supposed to be put in for Disney World's 50th anniversary. Uh, which isn't until October, and this is being filmed in late April. So kudos to them for getting it in. Looks very cool, at least from here. I can't wait to see it in the parks tomorrow. As we head back towards the dolphin, I'm wondering how much of this pyramid is not rooms. It looks like the rooms kind of stop right there, and then everything above is just maintenance or 
air conditioning, I have no idea. Elevators. Hey, Dad, let's go there. Do you want to go there tomorrow? Thank you guys so much for watching this quick video. This is the first in a lot of Disney World videos coming up on the channel. So stay tuned and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks so much and I'll see you guys in the next one.